See, any aspect of life, these things should not be separated. What people keep on asking, what is the diff uh, connection between life and love, life and spirituality, life and sport? These are all different dimensions of life. These are all different expressions of human life when someone lives intensely. If you live a tepid life, if you live a very, you know, <laughs> a life which doesn't have any intensity in it, then it'll be only about eating and sleeping and survival process. If anybody lives intensely, art will come, music will come, sport will come, spiritual process will come, it's bound to come. How will it not come? So it's about intensity and involvement. Where there's intensity, there is involvement. As I said, when Vivekananda said, you are closer to God in kicking a ball than in prayer. See, if you become practiced in your prayer, you can be praying and managing your children, you can be praying and thinking of hundred different things. But in kicking a ball, if you think about anything else, it'll not go where you want <laughs> You must be absolutely there, otherwise it won't work. So it is the intensity and involvement. Without it, there is no spiritual process. Spiritual process is the highest level of intensity and involvement. If you are involved with life intensely, you will be naturally spiritual. Spiritual does not mean looking up or looking down, exploring the nature of your existence. How can you not do that if you're intense, ab intense about your life? If your life matters, how can you not explore the full depth and dimension of who you are? Because that is what the spiritual process is.